He got dumped on. Holy crap. So I've already been out today, but man, it is insane how much snow we got. As you can see, we've been out. There's some people through here pulling in. Uh, but right now I have the neighbor kid coming over. He's got an ATV and I hired him to join our business because he has an ATV with a snow plow that can do sidewalks and stuff. So I was like, dude, it'll be perfect having him here. Right now for the setup, we have an F-250. It's the XLT. Got the old Fisher plow on there. Got the skid loader. Got the big tax trailer. And I think that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's Aston over there. So Aston should be showing up soon. And then we're going to get to work snow plowing. Oh, it's his first day too working for him. I think he's plowing his own house first though. I think he's going to knock that out. But we got a couple different places to plow. We got tractor supply. We got the gas station. We got uh, the Ram dealership down there, the Ram slash Ford dealership. There's a lot of different places we got to plow. And there's a place on the other side of town over there too. Yeah, we have to plow. So we got to get going. I think he's trying to get out of his driveway here. We got a Yamaha Grizzly. Hey, Steve, Yo. what's up, man? Yo, what's up? Hey, how you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. So, uh, okay, are you down to work today? Yeah, sure. Okay, okay, we have a ton to do. So I'm thinking, come over to my place and then we'll load up your ATV. We'll put it on the back of the trailer. Then we'll get going because I'm going to have you right. plow a lot of the sidewalks with your with your four wheeler. That'll work good. Okay, gotcha. Did you just get this plow though? You, you texted yeah, me I last did. night saying you just picked it up. Yeah, but... yeah it's really nice. Hey. Really, really nice. Okay, so we're going to do a revenue split on these, right? So Yeah, yeah, sure that works. What are you thinking? 20%? Does that sound good? I'll give you 20% of whatever we make on all these a lot. Mm, 25? Sounds like a deal, brother. All right. All okay. right, I'll come over there and meet you over there. Okay, sounds good. Hey, I can, uh, can you get through there with the ATV or are you, it's, it's pretty darn deep. Uh, I can try. Okay. Okay. I, you know what? I gotta plow my driveway anyway, so I'm going to start plowing. I'll start pushing snow around my driveway. So it's a lot All right, easier. Yeah. I gotta plow this anyway. Okay. Done for. All right. Okay. So I'm going to cold start the old F-250. She's been unplugged. She's been sitting outside. It's going to be a tough start. So we're going to see how she starts. Come on, puppy. These modern diesels aren't supposed to be as bad. Let's see how she starts. There we go. Okay. We got her started. We got to let her warm up. But seriously, in like real life, since I drive this truck in real life, what I want to do, one of the really cool things I want to do is see how well the modern diesel starts. It's so like when it gets cold out in real life, follow, uh, probably you can, you can follow the, my personal Instagram or this actually most likely follow the squad Instagram. I'll put it on there. But when I go to cold start this thing, like every morning, I'll like do a cold start for you guys. And I'll show you guys because it's basically going to be sitting unplugged. I'm not going to plug that thing in. I'll use glow, glow plugs. Other than that, if you want to see some cold starts, follow the squad underscore in Instagram, the squad underscore YouTube. It, there's a link down below. Anyways, yeah. But I'll put it on there. I'll, I'll make some stories and stuff over the winter because I'm curious to see how it does. Anyways, while we will let this warm up, I should probably get the skid loader fired up too. We got this cat, which I don't know if Austin knows how to run or not, but I, I might have him run this cat too. It'll work nice. We can get these lots cleared a lot quicker. So the cat we had plugged in, so that thing fired up right away. There's no need to even, that thing fired up quick. Oh shoot, we're almost stuck here. So what I'm gonna do, is we're gonna plow snow out of here once I hit my sidewalk. And we'll just most likely push this just kind of off to the left. It'll be quick, it won't be a perfect plow job, but it'll be, it'll be good. Dude, I love the sound animations that go with it too. Here we go. Nice, and then we'll probably just push snow just like across the driveway. Now I hear this is legal, but it's probably fine for now. We have so much snow, you just gotta do what you gotta do. There we go, drop her down, go to the right. It's nice seeing those, uh, shoot. I never really understood what these markers were for, but this is so nice seeing your markers here because some because you can't see over the hood of it. Now I know like Chevys in real life, Chevys, their hood is like, it's so big. It's so big and bulky in front of there where especially on Chevys, it's probably, which, nothing against that. I'm just saying for visibility purposes, when you're still plowing, it might be a little rougher. We're kind of caught on this curb here. But uh, it's nice having those markers on those plows there. I mean, I think pretty much every plow has a marker. Okay, so that's completely cleared right there. Now, I need to kind of clear around these trailers here. I'm going to shoot. There we go. We got her in reverse still. I'm going to drop her down. We're just going to push snow almost towards out to this fence. There we go. Put her in reverse. Back up. There we go, drop her down, go for it again. But we got like some giant lots to clear. So I don't want to spend much time on this. 
Dude, plowing snow is so fun. Like, how could you not have fun? The only way, if, if you do this, like, forever, 24-7, you're working, like, 16-hour shifts, maybe that's a little rougher. Okay, so I'm clearing a little spot across this grass right here, so that way we can at least pull out the trailer. And then, you know what, for the rest of it, I can just use the skid loader to kind of plow the rest. There we go. Lift her up. Nice. It's kind of, snow plowing's kind of a tedious job, so it's kind of tough to film everything, guys. An old mace, the power show, she's pushing. He's shaking, though. Okay, so I got my driveways complete. I got some of the edges cleared out. And now what I want to do is hook up to this trailer and then get the skid loader loaded up and then get uh, Aston's four-wheeler loaded up too. He should be here soon. Is he still going? You know what? Maybe we should see if he needs help with his. We can easily just take the skid loader over there. Holy crap. He's just doing it all by himself. Look at him go. Aston, man, do you need help at all? Yo. Yo, Aston, do you need help at all? Wait, is Aston. it? Aston. Aston. It's Austin. Austin. Oh, Austin. Austin. Sorry, I always forget. My bad. Uh, do you need help at all, man? Because this, help? Uh, this, uh, it looks like yeah. it looks like a like a blind dude just snow plowed this. <laughs> well, my plow doesn't. It, it leaves little bits of snow behind. Okay. So. Hey, I can. Uh, I can get the skiller over here. I can do it in a second, man. It'll be quick. Yeah, that would be that would be sweet. Okay. Honestly. I'll be I'll be over soon. All right. Then once we help him, we're just gonna get going here, and we gotta load up, and we gotta plow a lot of different lots. But what I was thinking about doing is starting some type of a business, snow plowing business, because we have uh, Austin, we have some other guys that would be, it, it, we could get it pretty fun with. I, I thought snow plowing is always fun when you're doing it with a lot of people, but it's nice. We have this cat skid loader with the f same Fisher snow plow, so this should be quick. Oh yeah, dude, works great. Here we go, and we'll just pile. It looks like he's piling it up by his fence here. Put her in reverse. We'll get this all cleaned up. Nice. There we go. Yo. Hey, I got her cleared. We're looking a lot better. All right. Yeah, it looks a ton better. Yeah. So do you okay? Do you want to take your four wheeler? We're driving over there, and we'll get loaded up on the trailer, and we can get going. Yeah, sure. Oh, yeah. yeah, that works. Just follow All me right. over there. I'll clear a path. Okay. Okay, big man. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna back up here, and then we'll put uh, we'll most likely put your four wheeler first on there, and then we'll put the skid loader second. Do you know how to operate that skid loader? Yep. Yep. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. That'll work good. Cause honestly, the sidewalks probably won't take that long, so you can jump on the skid yeah. loader. Help me with uh, a lot of the lots then. Yeah, for sure. There you go. Just slowly go up there. Nice. Slowly. And then, oh, <laughs> you can just keep going all the way. There we go. We can trap down your four-wheeler there. All right. You can just go all the way up there if you want. Yeah, the thing's a little jerky because the blade is a little heavy on it. Oh, so. okay. Probably lower the blade there you down go. here. I'll throw a strap there, and then uh, we throw a strap around back. There we go. Yep, there Perfect. we go. Hey, do you want to load up the skid loader too? Yeah, sure. Okay. All right, we got her. Yep, I got her strapped down the back, and then we should be able to strap her down the front. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, and then uh, so our first spot is kind of on the other side of town. So we'll run all the way down there, and then we'll, we'll work our way almost towards here because we got a lot of lots that are real close, close to here all right, too. Right, gotcha. Okay. All right. Just uh, jump in, uh, jump in the passenger seat. We'll get going. <clears throat> you sure you don't want to ride shotgun? I mean, we have room. Yeah, but... I'm. I'm positive. I'm positive. This is way more fun. It's gonna be a little cold back there, man. Uh, okay. Okay. You're it. good. You're good. It won't be that long. I'll, I'll go fast, man. You're good. I'll go fast. That'll make me more cold. Okay. I'm trying to plow through here. Just to kind of make a way so we can get through here at least and unload. Uh, this is kind of sketchy. We got a trailer on the back and we're pushing. It's all good though. I'm going to basically just push out here. I might back out, create one more lane here. This is like, this is so dangerous. 
There we go. Dude, imagine snow plowing with a 30-foot trailer behind you. Okay, I'm just going to do one more pass so we just got a little room to unload at least. Austin's probably like, what the heck is going on back there? There we go. Okay, that should give us enough room. Uh, I kind of want to unload the trailer so we can use the truck, but I don't know. Maybe we'll just use a skid loader. What? I was gonna What's say. I was, yeah, yeah, I was gonna. I was gonna say. I'm, I'm kind of thinking about just leaving the trailer connected to the truck. I don't really want to unhook the trailer, but I do want to use the truck. So, uh, let's see. Actually, there's not much sidewalk over here. Let's take a look here. I'm trying to remember I, if there was a sidewalk. I don't here. even think there's a sidewalk around here, honestly. Uh, there's. Okay, there's one sidewalk. It's tiny though. Oh, okay. Yep. So right through here. Can one you fit between these passes. trucks then? Uh, I could try. Okay. I I yeah, as long as you can fit down here, just do the sidewalk then. And then uh, yeah. I'll get the skid loader unloaded, I'll hook the trailer, and then you'll take over the skid loader uh, All right. right when you're done doing the sidewalk. Don't yep. like a plan? All right. Yep. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. Do you just want to back that off then? We'll unstrap yep. all this. There we all go. Right. You can fire up, and then I'll unstrap it. Austin, you mind if I drive your, your uh, ATV off? Yep. Go for it. Okay. Oh boy, this thing's tippy. Okay, there's your ATV. Jump on that, and then after you're done, jump on the skid loader, man. And I'll, I'll All unhook right. the trailer and uh, start plowing. Yep. Okay, so I gotta find a good place to put this trailer, because uh, I don't want to just keep it in the way here. Holy crap, dude. There's a little plow. He might struggle a little bit with that. Oh, man. Because we got to plow. Oh, you know what? That's going to be perfect for plowing in between the trucks, actually. If he. Yeah, that's going to be perfect for that. Oh, my gosh, dude. He almost hit a truck. Okay. Well, he's good. He's good, man. We got insurance. We're good. But I think what I'm going to do is just put the trailer somewhere back here in the snow. We'll just dump it back here. Some, a lot of this is grass. Some of it's sidewalk. It doesn't really need plowed for now. Uh, so we got to get the main stuff plowed through here, though. Okay, trailer's unhooked. So now all we're going to do is start plowing just right through here. Uh,. It looks like Austin's already plowing between the vehicles. That's kind of tedious. That's a tedious job through there. But I'll, I'll get through here. I'm actually going to move the skiddler out of the way, though. So we can get through here a little better. Nice job. Yo. Nice job, man. Is it a little rough through here? Yeah, it's a little rough. Yeah, there's but a lot of snow. It seems to be doing an okay job. Yeah, you're doing good. You're doing good, man. Keep it up. And then uh, I got the skid loader just sitting right there. So I'll All be right. using the truck. And then once you're done, hop in the skid loader. Alrighty. So there is a ton of snow to push. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to push it all the way from the dealership somehow. So for right now, like I'm going to push all this snow to the back lot. But I'm telling you right now, this is crazy how much snow we have. My truck is like floating on top of the snow. I'm just trying to get the blade down. Oh, there we go. Okay, perfect. So now we'll just push it all the way out to there. As you can see, I missed a ton through here, so we gotta go back and re-push this. Holy crap, oh shoot, dude. We are bottomed now. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Okay, come on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh shoot. Oh well, I guess this is why you need a lift kit or something. Holy crap, dude. That was just stupid of me to try to go over that pile. This is just, <laughs> this is insane. Well, Austin came and gave me a push, and so he took the skid loader and just pushed on the front blade. Unfortunately, I couldn't record that, but he just, like, pushed me up there, and then we came back down the other side. So we're all good. I gotta clear these piles, though. This is bad. This is real bad. There we go. Nice. Okay, so as we clear this, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the drone up in the sky, and we're gonna do a time lapse. I'll get a time lapse for you guys. If the drone has auto track, it should work fine. It should get it.
Yo. Hey, Austin, you know you can turn the yeah. blade on that, right? It can angle yep. side to side. Yeah, I just wanted to get the, the snow out of the front of the business there. Oh, okay, okay. I gotcha. Yeah. I gotcha. Yeah. Yep. Okay, I'm about done with this, and then, uh, man, <laughs> this is this is taking us a while, it seems like. So, yeah. Uh, we'll try to clean this up as best as possible, and then we'll try to head to the next job, but, man, this seems like it's taking forever. Yeah, it seems... Takes well with all the cars there, it takes just a while to get around them and stuff. So. Yeah, yeah. So there's still yeah. probably 20 minutes more work yet on this. So oh, for sure, for sure. All right. Yeah, man, I'd say we're good. I'd say we're done. It looks like we got a lot cleared for now. We can always come back and finish. It's going to blow and stuff, so it's going it's, we'll to have yeah. to come back anyways. Uh, but yeah. I'm thinking we can get loaded up, and we can head to the next job. Oh, man, this, this took a lot longer than I thought for sure. Yeah, m me too. But I think we did a fairly good job through here. Uh, yeah, we kind of did the best we could. Yeah, yeah. It's There's a ton of snow here, though, too. Dude, oh, yeah. you need to get a truck, man, because trucks. I know, I know. Trucks are a ton better. I, we need to get you, man. We need to work you up to a uh, uh, power stroke, man. Power was, stroke. Yeah. Power stroke. Now you say. What are you thinking? Uh, I don't know. I'm more of a Dodge guy. Are you 16 yet? Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. You much. can drive. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, man. Take uh, the drive the power stroke right now. See how it plows. Go in All right. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Uh, did you want to load up? and just go to the next business or do you want me to drive it right now? Yeah, let's load up and uh, head to the next business then. All right, okay. I, I kind of plowed out the trailer there for you. Okay, perfect. We'll get it connected and start loading up then. All right, I'll, I'll go grab the ATV. Then four. Oh, what are you doing, man? Holy crap, dude. That's insane. Holy what do you think about crap, that trick? Dude, that's insane. <laughs> the plow is a little too heavy for that thing, but yeah. it seems to work. Yeah. Okay, dude. Honestly, just tell us you're up there in the front, and then uh, I'll jump in the skid loader and I'll load the skid loader up. All right. Got her. There we go. We're all chained up. Let's uh, let's yep. head to the next job. All right. I'm just gonna ride on the ATV. It's okay. Way more fun. Well, guys, we have a ton more jobs to do, but we're not gonna get time to do it. So I'm thinking we'll do it like next snow plowing episode. Try to get those jobs done. This one just took forever to get completed. We got completed. We got loaded up. So. We're going to end right here, but seriously, hopefully you enjoyed the video. It was a little bit roleplay. It wasn't serious, dead, 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 dead realistic roleplay, you know, like crazy realistic roleplay, but it was kind of roleplay. Uh, it was fun having Austin on here helping us out. So you guys can check out his video too. It'll be down low in the description. Thanks for watching guys. And hey, I'll see you guys later. Sorry. I kind of have a cold, by the way. Uh, you, you can probably notice that in my voice. So thanks for watching guys. And hey, I'll see you later.